Hey there, Vinny from Project Frugal. In this video we're going to show you how long it takes to get a thousand subscribers and how much you can realistically earn, so check it out and stay tuned. Thanks for sticking around. We started this channel on the 28th of December 2020 and our vision was to help people with some useful frugal tips and how to get financially independent. That was the goal. Uh, unfortunately, there's been a few hiccups along the way. So we started off all good. The first mistake we made, we tried to recycle Denise's old channel. And that's a bad move because after six months, we'd actually made it to 100 subscribers. The way YouTube works, you couldn't actually change the channel name. So we were stuck with a custom URL. In this case, I think it was... Uh, ooh, Denise H label, something like that. That's what we were stuck with. But this channel is not Denise H label. That's her fashion label, by the way. This channel is Project Frugal. Suck it up and start from scratch. And at that time, I can't remember how many videos we'd done, but probably about maybe 30 or 40. We just hit the 100 subscriber mark, but we had to start again. So a bit of a flop there. So we started again back in June 2021. Yep, and it took quite a long time to actually get to a thousand subscribers. Lots of work, many hours doing editing, all that sort of thing. Many, many lonely hours. Anyway, many hours, lonely hours for me, because I do all the editing. Well, most of it, 99% of it, thanks to these. But we finally did make it, and yeah, I mean, I don't know how many videos we'd put out by the time we got to a thousand subscribers, I think it was roughly about 130, we'll go through the numbers soon enough, but a lot of YouTubers, they get despondent, and the majority of channels never actually make it to a thousand subscribers, let alone even a hundred subscribers, most of the channels are basically users who want to watch YouTube and never actually put any content out in the first place. Some people might put a couple of videos out of their children, dogs, pets, whatever, but that's as far as they want to go. Not for us. We want to actually make a difference, providing content that's hopefully useful to you, the viewer, and thanks for watching up to this point. Don't forget to hit the like button. Yeah, because we've got to say that over and over and over, because if we don't, YouTube is not going to push this video out, and we're not going to get the 5 million views that we're hoping for on this particular video. So it's up to you. And don't let me down. Please, please don't let us down. And because we're not full-time YouTubers, we've got to fit this particular journey along with, well, going to work, doing all the household chores, just like everyone else. So there is limited time to actually make content. If we were doing it professionally, we'd have enough time to do it. And we might even pay someone to do the editing and do the filming and all that sort of stuff. We are very low budget and we are very frugal, so we'll do it ourselves until we're making these 5 million views on each video and uh, making a, you know, a big wad of cash. Uh, yeah, maybe. So with that in mind, it's time to eat something because really got to eat something and there's not much time and it's going to be late and oh, I've got to go to bed, I've got to go to work, oh, what are we going to do? Anyway, we're going to eat this. And here we go, we've got this delicious gourmet meal, we've got some crackers, we've got some cheese, we've got some delicious fresh tomato, oh, some cucumber and some pickles and don't forget the hummus and don't forget the pineapple and i think that's about it because we've got no meat so uh this is what we're going with oh absolutely delicious oh oh yeah yeah oh ah, fantastic oh yeah oh that's in the spot oh that's great yeah mm, excellent yes mm. yeah you yep. And here we go. This was the first few videos that we made. We started off with red currant jam, which Denise had gone outside. We had a red currant plant outside. She'd picked some red currants. I think she made some jam. Yeah, <laughs> brilliant. So she made some jam, and we just used her one video that she'd made, chucked it on the channel. That's getting us started. And in the second video, we're off to buy a camera. So we needed some sort of decent camera to record with, and that's what we did. And then we started talking about our chickens and our frugal living, because that's what this channel is about, and got into a bit of financial independence as well. But that's where we started. We had to upload 
30 or 40 videos once we'd restarted the channel all the content back up starting the subscribers from zero again very disappointing i had to go and grovel to all the people who had subscribed please subscribe please subscribe uh, hopefully they're going to watch these videos hopefully you are watching this video if you're a subscriber shame on you and that's what we did we had to re-upload and we've been constantly uploading since then we've got how many videos have we got here we've got 160 odd videos so in terms of the uh video to subscriber uh yeah okay it's not that flash but you just gotta plug away at this thing it's not an easy simple task and each one of these videos could take anywhere from let's say an hour for a short video or an easy easy to edit video easy to film all that sort of thing you got to do all the research you got to do the editing you got to do the filming you've got to get the audio right you got to upload it you got to make a thumbnail you got to do the comments there's quite a lot of work that goes into these so anywhere from an hour up to i think the longest work on a video might have stretched up to maybe 16 hours and when you're getting a handful of views it can be quite demoralizing but rome was not built in a day in fact Rome took a lot longer to build than actually a week even. Longer than a week, that's right. So are the views actually increasing? Well, it's up and down like a yo-yo, so we're still working out what we're doing. It's almost two years into this. Some of these uh, videos only get, a well, literally 15 views for this one nine days ago. Road to 100k, I highly recommend that if you want to follow our investing journey. So far, 15 people have, and I don't know how many times I've watched it, but probably only once. So that's a good endorsement, right? We've done a few other sort of things. We had an interview with a lady from Australia who is a FIRE person, which stands for Financial Independence Retire Early. I can highly recommend watching that video to see what she's doing so she can retire earlier. And all sorts of things. We've done a review on some headphones that I bought recently. I'm repairing the roof all sorts of things we've got a solar system we've been rung up by scammers we're fixing the roof we've cooked some cheap food stuff that i like and eventually we'll narrow down the content to find out what works for you the viewer so if you've got any recommendations leave it down in the comments below of what you want to see because without that well we're not going to have any viewers simple as that Denise has also done some videos on fashion because she does some upcycling, so she turns old bits of scrap fabric into other things. Great idea. And we also did a series on Hyperverse, which is one of the biggest Ponzi ripoff schemes out there at the moment, even though it's hypothetically collapsed. You got to watch it to check it out. But that's our most successful video 10,000 views on one particular video. Unfortunately, at the time, our channel was not monetized. But it did help boost our subscriber numbers and push the numbers up because at the end of the day anyone who's watching these videos on scammy investments well we can teach them something about how to invest properly and actually how to really make some money and if we have a look at some of the highest paid youtubers this is in 2022 obviously we got mr beast at the top with 54 million dollars in revenue that's pretty impressive all the way down to well number 10 preston I'm not going to pronounce that surname, but Preston, that's the guy. He made $16 million. I'm not sure if this is just the ad revenue, including endorsements or any sort of uh, promotions or what have you. Maybe it is, maybe it's not. I don't know. But the ad revenue from YouTube is not that great. So you can also do some affiliate marketing, i.e. sell some worthless products on YouTube and get people to click and buy on them. Now, besides ads on videos, there's also other methods of making money on YouTube. One of those methods is selling courses. I don't have a course to sell. Maybe one day we will, but at this stage we don't. The other one is affiliate marketing, where I sell you this beautiful set of headphones here. Uh, the link is in the description below. Uh, make sure you go and buy this from Amazon.com. And No, we're not going to actually do that. But um, the good news is, uh, with the new WIPO toilet paper, this is the perfect toilet paper for wiping your bottom after you go to the toilet. So as long as you click on the link here down below, you can get a 10% discount on WIPO toilet paper. That would be very much appreciated. Thank you very much. Okay, seriously, we're not going to be promoting anything apart from this Pam's coffee. Delicious Pam's coffee, the coffee of choice. Yeah. Okay, but seriously, we could promote some stuff. We're going to work on that down the track. 
but they're going to be products of useful value. I mean, hey, let's face it, this is useful, right? Yeah. And when I say to you, why Nui Mata, Mountain Glacier, Dew, Spring Water, you'll know what I'm talking about when that video comes out, because we've got our own water bottling plant, but you have to watch and find out. And make sure you subscribe and like this channel. And here's some more stats. All the links will be down in the description below for this before we get into our actual numbers. So last year, well, 2021, YouTube generated $28.8 billion in revenue. That's a substantial amount of money. And I've got a lot of uh, users on this particular platform. $8.8 .8 billion in the last quarter of 2021. What else have we got there? Google bought YouTube for $1.65 billion. That sounds like a bit of a good deal, really, considering they're making $28 billion in revenue. That's a bit of a bargain, I'd say. Uh, what do we got there? YouTube video influencers uh, with 500 to 5,000 followers charge on average $315 per video. So there you go. If you want to hire me as your influencer, I'll charge you, well, we'll shave a dollar off there, I think, $314 per video. Yeah, I'll promote your fish and chips if that's what you want or whatever you're after. Yeah, sign me up. And then, of course, you got the influencers with 500k plus who charge on average $3,857 per video, so substantially a lot more. In fact, if you made a video a week and you were, you know, you were doing some sort of influencing and you were making $3,800 a week, uh, that'd be quite good, actually. Yeah, it'd be quite good. I think I would possibly even quit my job if that was the case. Anyway, uh, YouTube pays $18. Well, I guess this is some sort of average. There's a link to this article here. I'll put this article down in the description below anyway. YouTube pays $18 per 1,000 ad views on average. So, yeah, that's not a great deal, but uh, maybe it all adds up. And most YouTube channels get paid $0.50 cents per 1,000 views. Not a lot of money there, is it? Now, if we've got some videos that only get, say, let's say 100 views, we're making $0.05. Cents. Hmm. So if the video takes an hour... We could be making five cents an hour. That's quite good. So, yeah, if you want to get rich like Mr. Beast and all those other influencers, you come to the right place. You can follow Project Frugal where we can guarantee, well, not quite guarantee, that you could make five cents an hour for making video content and putting it onto YouTube. There's a lot of other interesting facts about YouTube. Second most visited site in the world. That'll be after Google.com, of course counts for 25% of total global mobile traffic. Uh, what else we got there? First video was posted in 2005, not that long ago really, 17 years ago, from San Diego Zoo, and no doubt that's got probably millions and millions, if not hundreds of millions of views. It provides free space in Los Angeles. Well, that's useful for anyone with 10,000 plus subscribers. Well, that's handy considering we don't have 10,000 subscribers and we don't live in Los Angeles. So not bad, not bad, not bad. Plenty more facts on there. Anyway, we'll go into the money shortly. So we're going into our channel analytics for Project Frugal and, well, yeah. Estimated revenue, $14.33 over the last 28 days. So there you go. That's 50, 50 cents a day. It's pretty good. So if we can just maybe, uh, you know, maybe improve that by... I don't know, 10,000 times, we'll be starting to make some decent money, I'd say. You know, if we can get maybe $500 a day, $50, $5 a day would be good if we can uh, increase it by 10 times. So if we had 10,000 subscribers, we could be making $5 a day. That's probably realistic, I'd say, maybe. Here's some days here. We'll just have a look at these and some of our top performing videos. So look, on the uh, Wednesday, October the 26th, 2022, we made 51 cents. Well, there, there we go. There's our 50 cent average. And a whopping $2.20 on the Thursday. Fantastic. Oh, but uh, yeah, it's been a bit doom and gloom in the last few days. 15 cents, 31 cents, 15 cents, 15 cents, 33 cents. Hey, it's better than nothing, right? 19 cents. Well, that's 19 cents I didn't have the other day. Well, actually, hang on. This is the other day. Uh. I don't know how that's working out. Basically, peanuts. Peanuts is what you can expect. So if you're in this for the long haul, you're going to have to be in it for the long haul. Guaranteed. So until you can build up the views and the subscribers and just keep tuning out content 
And YouTube is a content hog. You've just got to keep pumping out content, content after content after content. It's a hungry beast. And if you stop producing content, everything goes south. And the YouTube algorithm doesn't like you anymore. And your videos, well, you find it hard to get traction to increase your viewership and subscribers and all that sort of stuff. And people start leaving and you get demonetized and then it's a big waste of time. So you've got to keep going with this thing. You just start, you get the taste of it, and you just got to pump out the content, regardless of whether you want to or not. <laughs> there are some silver linings with this, because the more you do it, the easier it becomes, the quicker you get at editing, the better content ideas you get. And I mean, this video is probably going to go viral. I'm expecting maybe 15, maybe even 20 views, maybe 20, 25 views, perhaps which should garner us, uh, you know, a cool crisp five cents, uh, maybe another six, seven, eight, nine, ten cents, whatever. I mean, it all adds up, right? Yeah, definitely not doing it for the money at this stage, that's for sure. We're doing it for the enjoyment factor. We're doing it to teach you, the viewer, hit the like button, please hit the like button. Uh, yes, we're doing it for you, the viewer, so that, well, hopefully you're going to learn something. We're definitely going to learn something. Hopefully you can learn something. At the end of the day, this channel is about saving money and building wealth and i want you to do exactly that so regardless if you watch this channel and a whole bunch of other channels everyone wins everyone will be better off if they can get rid of their debt build wealth and obtain financial independence so that's what we're trying to do and if we change this here for the lifetime of the channel knowing that it started in june 2021 or oh, here we go june the 11th 2021 and it took us till, when did we get monetized? What do we got there? Ooh, one more day, September, September the 4th, September, that's the 10th, 9th month. So 15 months roughly from the rebirth of this channel, it's all the way to get to a thousand subscribers and get the actual monetized portion of it. You've got to do a few things, a few bells and whistles. You've got to send in some bank account details. They send you a piece of paper. I got it somewhere somewhere over there, which has got a code on it, which you have to put into a, a one of their Google websites so you can get paid and verify that you are who you say you are and it's come to your address for tax purposes, all that sort of thing. But it's worth doing. I mean, oh yeah. The threshold for a monthly payment is in New Zealand is $130. We've made $45.13. So, well, we're a third of the way there to actually get one single solitary payment, and that's presumably before tax. So what are we looking at? September, we're just about in December. So September, October, November, so three months. Oh, $45. That's $15 a month. Yeah. All right. I'm going to probably quit my job tomorrow. Yeah, I mean, 15 bucks a month. That's, yeah, it's not ideal, is it? 50 cents a day. Uh, never mind. But hopefully we can grow this over time. And I know we will because we're going to persevere regardless of what this looks like. And it's something that you just have to keep doing. Mr. Beast himself produced hundreds of videos before he got up to, I think it was 10,000 subscribers or what have you. But in terms of his channel, it's a, it's a, it's a super large channel now. Well, over 100 million subscribers. Everything starts tiny. You start with your first video get a viewer a subscriber and it just basically grows from there and as long as you're doing the right things it will keep growing so $45.13 that's how much we've made an average of $15 a month now I was hoping for more than that $20 a week would be nice for all especially for all the uh, effort that goes into this but it's going to come down the track we'll make $20 a week one day maybe we'll even make $100 a week with a lot of effort and a lot more focus now, I found this other article here. So if you're just starting out on your YouTube journey, how long does it take to get a thousand subscribers? I'll put the link down below in the description. Now, this is an old video. This is from 2017. So it's over five years old, almost six years old. But I thought it was very interesting in terms of having a look at the comments and seeing what's happened to these particular people. So they've got some comments here in terms of what people had said. How long does it take to get a thousand subscribers? So you get monetized, the fast ones. Two months of serious hustle to get our channel to 1K. So like I said, it took us 15 months plus 
realistically another six months for the first six months that got wiped out due to our silly mistake. Took them, well, this one, this guy says it took six weeks, reckless eating, okay. Uh, this one says it took about six months to get to a thousand subs, great. We got medium fast ones, around a year, took me two years of on and off work. Uh, the ones that took a little longer, the ones who are still working on it, three years and we're still at 470 subscribers. I have 164 subs after five years. At this pace, I should hit 1,000 before I die, possibly in about 45 years. Clearly, it all depends on what sort of content you're producing, whether people engage with it, whether they watch it. If no one watches your videos, then the YouTube algorithm will not promote it on the various bits and pieces, i.e. the homepage, the suggestion, the, the whatever. Uh, they're not going to do that. So, uh, yes, please like this page. Uh, like this video please um that would be most most appreciated thank you very much uh comment below um all the usual bells and whistles thank you very much uh don't forget to like uh yeah okay right enough of that now the author of this article anna does say can't wait to hit a thousand subscribers let's face it the grind of building your channel can be pretty demotivating especially if you're at the beginning well we're not we're a thousand subscribers in thank goodness even though it's been a hard graft. And what's worse, YouTube doesn't even update your subscriber numbers live. Getting to a thousand subs will most likely take some time, while there are certainly some people who are able to get there in the in a few weeks or months. Many YouTubers take a lot longer. No matter where and how fast you are, though, it's important to put in time and effort. Without that, you might never pass a thousand subs. So we do have some comments on this. We're going to examine some of these comments and see what's happened. We got Pushing Stairs, so they had 31 subscribers after four days of YouTubing, and now their channel does not exist. Well, there we go. So five years later, dead. We got Destroyer Blade Gaming, I have 30, 139 subs after about three months, I'd love support. Subscribe to Destroyer Blade Gaming, so let's go and uh, see if we can dig those people out. And I can't see them anywhere here, so they might be dead as well. Ethan plays ZYT. Uh, he had, what did he have? He had uh, three weeks in. Hoping at least three weeks now to have 100. I have 58 right now. Does he still exist? Does Ethan still exist with his channel? He doesn't with his video. Hmm. Here we go. Stephanie's daughter got a two minute video and she has 52 subscribers and 183 views. In two forty-eight hours. <laughs> wow, if I could do that, well, I'd be doing that. Let's go and have a look at that one. What Gabby? Where Gabby goes? Okay, so five years later, nine hundred and twenty-three subscribers. We're going to do a little bit more in depth looking at that one. And I'll show you how we're going to do that because you might find this interesting. So we'll chuck her on the list. Where Gabby goes, who else we got here? We got Rupee Breach, YouTube Rupee Breach. Just hit 60 subscribers today. My goal is to reach 1,000 by the end of the year. Let's have a look at Rupee. Here she is here. Okay, she's got a channel. So she got 163 subscribers. Just hit 60 subscribers. So she only put on another 103 subscribers in the last five years. Okay, we'll check out her channel as well. And finally, one more that we'll look at. Vincent Goa, opened account in August 2015, started in November 2017. So what's that? That's five years ago now. And he got to 500, hoping to get to 1,000 by the end of August. Radi radi ra. I'm a prankster and a vlogger. Let's go and check him out. Five years later, he had 500 odd subs. And where has he got to now? Well, he's doing all right. He's got 42,000 subscribers. He's had over well almost 11 million views last 30 days almost 2 million views so he's cranking it out he's carrying on he's keeping it going well done to you as well sir okie dokie so here we go i've made this custom application where i am going to add a channel we're going to load up the four channels that we've selected and it's going to fail <laughs> oh great oh super Right, so here's our, one of our channels here. We've got Rupee Breach, 
And uh, yep, she's got no videos because clearly she's deleted the lot. Where Gabby goes, uh, what has she got? She's got 923 subscribers, only 10 videos, and she hasn't uploaded since 2018. So here's her last 10 videos. And how did she do on those? So she, well, actually, her, one of her videos went viral with 117,000 views. So why would you stop if you got 117,000 views just because your next videos don't go that well? That was literally on her second ever video. 117,000 views. That's incredible. And then uh, she's got a few more and, uh, well, they've done okay. I'd be happy with numbers like that. 500 odd views per video. Average of 12,500 12 views per video. 923 subscribers, only 10 videos, 124,000 views. Why did she stop? It was right there. She just needed to carry on, do a little bit more. Bang. I don't know. Cut a long story short, it's not that hard. Well, it is hard, actually. <laughs> it is hard. It just takes one video, and that one video could set your channel off. You could instantly get monetized you could actually make some money off youtube just one video that's all it takes if you come up with the right idea at the right time for something that people are interested in whatever that is because there's all sorts of channels out there and people are interested in all sorts of things people are interested in finance they're interested in being entertained they want to learn something if you can combine all of those things into one video that's what you might need to go viral on youtube and actually make some sort of decent money out of it well, there we go. That wraps it up. Not much more to add there, so not a great result there in terms of the money. It is certainly enjoyable, and we'll carry on doing it. So don't forget to like and subscribe. Remember, we need your likes. If we're ever going to grow this channel, it's up to you, and I'm relying on you. That's right, you. Catch you in the next video. See you later.